Damn, dude. What? Damn, dude. What? God damn. What the fuck is wrong with you? So before the series ended, I wanted to do at least one full reaction. And it, full reactions are hard because I have a hip injury. And after about 90 minutes of sitting, it starts hurting. Which means I couldn't consistently do full reactions for hour-long shows. Because, as you can see, every other show I'd have to get up, right? And so, um, it just doesn't work. I've been doing full reactions for the half-hour shows. But like there has to be like special circumstances. Like a, a very special episode. But the problem is, I didn't want to do a full reaction for the finale of Sopranos, because I'm feeling there's going to be a lot to say about it. A lot. Like, that's probably going to be something where I may do three or four videos. I may break the finale up into three or four videos. It, it depends. It depends how much there is to talk about. I'm assuming there's going to be a lot. So I didn't want to do that. So, I also didn't want to do it like, you know, there's a chance of Chrissy dying maybe in one of the last three or four episodes. So I don't, I, and when Chrissy dies, there's going to be celebrations, there's going to be champagne, there's going to be popcorn. I'm going to be pausing the fuck out of it. So, uh, I didn't want that. So I wanted, it had to be early, but I didn't want it to be a premiere. So basically, the point is, by the process of elimination, a random third episode of the season is what I fell on. So this episode is going to be a full rush. Let's just get into this shit. I wonder if, how much different this show would be if it had been shot, say, assuming James Gandolfini would still be alive, obviously, you know, because we'd have to have him as Tony. You have to have him. Um... 2015 to 2025, essentially. You know, it's the area of social media is what I'm talking about. Because social media, I think, would have been some interesting storylines. Also, you just don't hear about the mob anymore. Maybe they've been destroyed. Maybe they just don't exist anymore. Because I, I, I can't tell you the last time I've heard a story about the mob in the news. It's been a fucking long time, man. Don't take this the wrong way, but I'm kind of surprised he actually washes his face in the morning. I mean, he just doesn't seem like that hygienic of a dude. I'm just saying, man. Well, this can't be good news. Got a call from Sergeant Danny over in North PD. Oh, shit. Yeah. And? Paulie's always got a relaxed outfit. You notice that the sweatpants, the sweatshirt. Oh, Willie shit. Overall, the bookie. Labor oh, Day Oh, shit, not the bookie. <laughs> are, are we talking about the bookie? Is that what he means? <laughs> that means somebody's been snitching, right? Because they're going straight to it. Chris, he's snitching. Can we get him out of the paint? You made your bones with that prick, eh? Oh, he told him, come yeah. on, kid, do it. That was Polly ordering Tony to do it, huh? Oh, when is the, um, the prequel? When does that take place? Before or after what they're talking about here? I know the drill, Tony. Damn, why are you so fucking irritated? I mean, you know, because you, you know, got it's not like I shit. want a trip to Paris. <laughs> well, yeah, nice callback. Oh, man. He's a meticulous, fastidious motherfucker, isn't he? Look at him. His shit down. Talk about hygiene. This, you know, this dude, he, he probably cleans under every fingernail and shit. You know, cleans up his nose. And, like, this dude's probably, his shit's probably immaculate, you know? Gambling charge. That's all. It's going to be fine. It's just, you know, better safe than sorry. I know. It's just. Yeah, a little gambling charge. That's the ticket. You're not repeating yourself so much. You gotta get me yeah, out of here. Yeah, you're not repeating yourself so much. Wait, did I already say that? Fucking place. Yeah, well, yeah. But here's the thing. That's one of the stereotypes. With Dad's nursing home, it didn't stink, man. Those nurses were fucking... They kept that shit great, man. <laughs> He's nuttier than a Snickers bar. <laughs> so this is gonna be... A, oh, fuck. That's old boy from Lost, man. Let me see. This was 2007. He left this show and immediately... Because uh, 2007 was season three of Lost. Season four of Lost, he appeared on Lost. So he did this and went straight from here to Lost. Well, you talk about a career arc, man. That's two, that's two incredible fucking paychecks that increase your profile. Watch this be his only scene, though, you know? Damn, he's running an operation. Are you serious? Sixty dollars. For sodas and fucking candy? <laughs> Caffeinated sodas and sugar. You know some of them yeah. ain't allowed this shit. Get some more around. Shit. I could lose Get my job. Get me paid, bitch. <laughs> Don't be talking shit to the dude that's got your back, man. He's running this operation like he just, it's like it's 50 years ago. Ice cold. Yeah, now we're talking. Five buttons. Plus, we got Snickers, Kit Kats, and wait, Sprees. Wait, wait, did he say five bucks for Coke? Is that what the fuck I just heard? Back in 2007, money? You must be out of your goddamn mind. 
Uh, if you say so. Yeah, I get to kiss your ass for two or three straight days. Yeah. You get to kiss your ass for two or three straight days. This is going to be fucking awesome. Willie, I brought an extra mouthwash. No, metal. Nice is going to be a doctor. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I want to hear. Fuck that lawyer shit. Kevin Chase. Fuck ever happened to him. Uh, he's an asshole. Nobody wants to work with him anymore. You mentioned Ralph before. A few years ago, he had that beef with Johnny Sack. He made a crack about Ginny. You fucking right. hole on her ass or some shit. Oh, fucking yeah. shit. This is going to come out. Who the fuck would tell Johnny about that joke? How should I know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Got a guilty conscience. Guilty conscience is fucking with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't be playing poker with these old motherfuckers. Help him for Christ's sake. Parage He's dead. What a what a chicken shit game, man. The pride of Rutgers. Slits his wrist <laughs> in the faculty lounge. F Damn, why are you airing out room. my business, motherfucker? How about I slit your wrist? <laughs> Jesus. Some of us what a dick. know when we need help. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, <laughs> he'll kick your ass. <laughs> this is probably his high water mark. It'll never get this good for him again, and this ain't very good. What's going on, guys? Oh, shit. Happening, Warren. Relax, Brian. This motherfucker snitched? Let me say about Are you this. serious? Well, it's a friendly game. Corrado, this it's motherfucker snitched. God damn, man. Oh, my God. You know what happens to snitches? Holy shit. I saw your girl today at pet therapy. How'd she keep her coat so shiny? <laughs> What's up? Man, Junior's killing it, man. God damn, his brain may be gone, but his fucking Huber uh, cerebellum or whatever it is, it's still firing on all cylinders. Of course, it's probably a bunch of old jokes, right? You did a good job tonight, kid. Here's your taste. Oh, good taste. It's all right. <laughs> Take it. You earned it. I don't need no buttons. Yeah, thanks for the buttons. <laughs> when crack, my old man gives me a belt right across the mouth. God damn. What are you, millionaire? You no need of money? You no like it? <laughs> mm. Even still, he was right. Yeah. He made me walk home that night. God damn. So wait, wait, you can't get two punishments. Hold on. Hold on, motherfucker. You can't get hit in the mouth and have to walk home. You gotta be shitting me. Like one punishment or the other. You get hit in the mouth or you walk home. You can't do both. Tell one when he can fuck himself. Yeah. Probably bad to come see me. <laughs> He runs a... Thank you, Kat, at least. <laughs> you fuck off. this guy. He runs a... fuck out of here. <laughs> God damn, man. There's still some of the old junior in there. Do you remember that place? Uh, man, it's probably going to get right this episode. Beds. It's in Culpeper, Virginia. Behaving there. Ah. We met those 16-year-old talking... hillbilly hoods and had a taxi uh, Damn. <laughs> Wait, 16? What the fuck are you talking about? Let's go there. We'll get a room, fucking ice on a machine, bottle of scotch. Get some maybe hookers at our age this time, maybe, you know? Hey, if... I bet the place has completely changed. It's probably a right. Chuck E. Cheese, though. Six to ten, we offer a complimentary buffet breakfast in the... Yeah, it's going to suck ass. Sign there, please. Powdered eggs. You, uh, you got to make your own damn waffle. Open, though. You could get some nachos. Man, nachos? <laughs> that looks like they got boy. nachos, so I guess, you know. I was mad, but I guess I shouldn't have been. I got no driver's license. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. I'm shitting a brick. This is the He's deep fucking no south license. we're in. I wear a tie Yeah, <laughs> you're fucked. Dad. What do I tell this prick? My cousin's a state trooper, too, I tell. Maybe you know him. Oh, shit. What's his name? Bonnie Fife. Pow. Oh, my God. <laughs> You gotta be shitting me. I don't know what the fuck hit me. Your dad's fucking pissing himself. I mean, I don't watch TV. I don't fuck the wine already. Right? <laughs> oh, yeah, God damn, man. Your dad had to dope the guy a hundred fucking dollars. <laughs> <Probably had nuts. laughs> Jesus Christ, man. You gotta no, be shitting me. Be he did just to fuck with him. Fucking Jesus Jenny, Christ. man. He sounds like an asshole to me. <laughs> he loves you, Never know where I stood with him. Well... Because he was an asshole, just like AJ don't know where he stands with you. I don't mind paying for the tailpipe, but that fucking muffler's still on the warranty. Oh, <laughs> that? Yeah. Like I said, just tell the punchline, you don't have to tell the joke. Enjoy Miami. <laughs> oh, shit. 
How does he know where the we're fuck going? Is wrong with you? I'm fucked up, Polly. I'm gonna grab some Danish for the world. Yeah, I've been reprimanded. Now I need to eat more. Dick. Damn, dude. Damn, dude. God damn. What the fuck is wrong with you? Holy shit. Like, he was still grabbed. They didn't even show the end of him grabbing all that shit, man. <laughs>